All right, what's going on everyone, Mr. Here? Hope you're all doing absolutely fantastic today, as always. And welcome back to another episode of GTA Ultimate Zombie Apocalypse Survival. Now, uh, oh, I've just given away... You didn't see anything, okay? You didn't see nothing just then, okay? Let me let me explain. So a couple things have changed since the last episode. So if you remember, I'm not sure if you watched all the way... All the way... Yeah, it's definitely given it away, but... <laughs> if you didn't watch all the way through, we ended up talking to Ron, which obviously was Trevor's friend over at Trevor's house, and, uh... Yeah, after the stream ended, uh, hung out with him for a bit, had a couple beers, and, uh, he ended up letting me know that Trevor and Franklin, in fact, are alive. I mean, Michael and Franklin. And, uh, yeah, well, I can't, it's, uh, guys, you guys need to stop, okay? Because, uh, you know, I was trying to just, I was trying to, I was trying to get it, I was trying to make it a surprise, guys. Oh, you give me I got hives. one too. You ruined the surprise. It's a, it's not a surprise anymore. But anyway, we have some friends because you know in a zombie apocalypse, in any sort of apocalypse at all, it gets pretty lonely. Okay, there's a lot of people that are just uh they're just they're just survivors, but they're, they're threats. Okay, you can't listen. Okay, I'm gonna need to configure you guys quickly, and uh, I'll just I'll just let's configure you to uh configure you to follow. Yeah, yeah, follow. Because you guys need to relax just a little bit. Okay. Okay, yeah, you guys, you guys just follow me, okay? No need to shoot birds out of the sky and shoot random zombies just yet. Uh, you guys should have Rain suppressors. But, uh, yeah, anyway, it can get quite lonely in a zombie apocalypse. So, I thought uh, it would be good. So, uh, yeah, me and me and Ron, as I said, we, we met him in the last Run episode, away. right near the end. We ended up going around and finding them, because he, he uh, told me that he actually seen them wandering around. But he's not that great friends with them, so he told me that... Obviously, Trevor is good friends with him, so he said, uh, let's go and find him. And we did. We got him, and uh, they're with us now, so that's pretty cool. They're, they're down, and, uh, you know, I wasn't sure. Like, I trust them. Obviously, me, myself, Trevor, I've been a bit of an idiot in the past, you know. But, uh, yeah, they, they trust me in this hey, kind of situation. I all, but... That's what I'm telling you. You didn't hear him say, but, okay? You just heard him say, I trust you, okay? There was no questions about it. But, uh, yeah, anyway, for this episode, I really want to find a proper base. So, I did start the base here. Oh, let's quickly just hop down. These guys should follow me. Yeah, come on, guys, come on. Uh, it was just over here. I had my tent and my campfire and, uh, my, uh, oh, I forgot to load it, actually. Sorry, let me just quickly load. There we go. Got my, got my tent there. I'll go ahead and pick that up, so I've got it in my I'm inventory. Out. But, uh, yeah, what we want to do is try and find a proper base today. Now, I have an idea for uh, where I want it to be. So, we're going to head over there shortly. Let me just pick up everything here. Uh, I think I have another wall over here. Did I pick that up? Yeah, there we go. There it is. Okay. So, we've got all the walls, got everything, got it all picked up. And, uh, yeah, we're going to, we're going to, we need to find a car and we're going to try and keep this car for now. Um, and, yeah, we're going to, I think it would be a good idea to put our weapons in the back of it since you can store your weapons uh in the back of cars here actually there's a car over there i just saw might take that you guys think we'll take that one yeah i mean it'll fill fit all of us we should be good so yeah we'll go ahead and grab that and uh then uh yeah i'll, I'll keep it as a bit of a surprise of where we're going i have something in mind obviously i've played grand theft auto for many many years i know the map like the back of my hand and uh before the stream i was i was thinking of thinking of where i could possibly set a base and i was going to leave it up to you guys uh, in the comments for the next episode, but I, uh, actually have quite a good idea. But quickly, before we get into it, uh, obviously if you, if you enjoy it, make sure to leave a like. You, if you don't, leave a dislike. And, uh, yeah, we're almost at 2,000 subscribers here, so, uh, yeah, subscribe if you want to see more. But, uh, yeah, I just quickly want to show you something, okay? This is something <laughs> that happened just before stream, okay? Let me go to full face. So, my microphone, you can see, you can see some tape there. About 15 minutes before I went live, I was adjusting my microphone and it actually snapped and broke off. And uh, yeah, I had to quickly improvise. So, this is just held on by duct tape at the moment. And it absolutely stinks. But uh, <laughs> I just thought I'd let you guys know that was uh, probably the worst thing that can happen 15 minutes before stream. Uh, well, there's probably worse things, you know. But it's pretty, pretty bad. So, I'm going to have to wait until the 7th of uh, September for my... My new mic to come through anyway. Hey, Kos Kosponis? Kosponis, hey, what's up, man? This car is very good. Yeah, yeah, it's a pretty decent car. I mean, it's good. It's got it's got some decent fuel, too. But yeah, thanks for stopping by. I hope, you, hope you're doing well. Uh, so, yeah, as I said, I'm going to leave it, leave it a bit of a secret, and we're going to head to where I think will be a good idea to start our base. Now, in the last episode, if you watched all the way through, you'd, you'd also know 
We killed a lot of zombies in that episode. We've got a lot of resources, so we're completely stacked on resources. So we have a lot of things we can craft and build, like walls and, and gates and sand blocks and stuff to keep us safe from the zombies. So, yeah, we're definitely going to be uh, crafting a bunch of stuff there once we get there. But this place is pretty cool. I mean, it's got vending machines too. I'm not sure if, if it's actually going to replenish my thirst. Uh, obviously, if you're just stopping by and this is your first episode, uh, yeah, you should go and watch the first episode anyway. This is the second one, but you do have Thirst and Hunger in this. It's a full-fledged survival game. It's pretty cool. But yeah, I'll give you a hint to where we're going. It is in town, and it is in the airport. So that's where we're heading right now. So, uh, hey man, why aren't you looking? Franklin. It's okay, you can speak Franklin. <laughs> really funny thing, as I uh, first got... Uh, Franklin and Michael on my team just before stream it was really funny because <laughs> I was setting them up and everything like that uh, and yeah they were just shooting birds out of the sky they were just shooting birds out of the sky and <laughs> disrespecting the birds I think the way uh, I think the way they work is anything that moves that isn't a friendly shoot it even bees flies particles wind everything so yeah, I think we have a jerry can on us too from the last episode, so that should be good. Otherwise, there is a fuel station up here. I might actually quickly stop for a pit stop there and see if we can get an extra jerry can. So we can fill this thing up. I mean, this is a good first car, so once we stop up here, I'll put some weapons in the back, ones we might not need. And I think it might also be a good idea to, uh, once we get a good amount of weapons, um, maybe actually have, like, little stash spots, so... If we're on the other side of the map or somewhere, we'll at least be able to know we can stop here and, uh, you know, pick up some spare weapons if need be. Uh, oh, there's also a store. I should get some loot while I'm there. No jerry can here? Doesn't look like it. Alright, boys, hop out. Uh, we got we got some looting to do real quick. You guys just hang out, okay? No need to shoot. No need to shoot. Then upgrade. Go in city, then build camp for now. Then upgrade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what we're gonna do. Just get my loot and stuff, and then we're gonna go to my secret base spot and uh, set that up. Oh, and when you say upgrade, do you, uh, do you mean what, what do you mean by upgrade? Upgrade what exactly? Hostiles nearby, apparently. And yeah, just so everyone knows. Sorry, Would Franklin. Hostiles nearby don't mean zombies. That means like enemies. Actually, I should refuel while I'm here. Wait, it said I could refuel, but now it says I can't. I do have quite a few weapons. Uh, yeah, let's uh, Idiot. take you out. I think we're good. Actually, I'll quickly configure you guys to save me. Um, I'll set you to guard. And I'll set you to guard. Okay, Franklin, you got to guard me. I'm just uh, putting, putting some extra stuff in the boot. So you guys take care of me. Well, I'll do this. Now, uh, put item. No, I, I, I want to take item. I'm gonna take F. Okay, so let me put that in there. I'll put, uh, I mean, we need our sniper. We've got, we've got a few assault rifles we can put in. Um, wait, how do I? Sorry, this is kind of confusing, but I need to put them in there anyway. So, it's going away. Numpad for... It's not letting me swap the, sw the slots. Okay, we'll figure that out when we get to base, okay? This is getting dangerous. So, uh, yeah, let's just go to base. Come on, boys, hop in. Zombie behind you, Franklin! You guys are silly. You guys are silly. Hello. Franklin. Franklin! Listen, nobody likes you. What the fuck? Jeez. Franklin, you need to just follow. Okay, come on. Come on, guys. We need to get out of here. <laughs> Move. Quick, you better get in. There's a runner, unless you want to take him out. Why are you guys just walking? It's dangerous. Alright. <laughs> 
Oh, man. Play alone. I mean, I'd like to play alone. I mean, in the first few uh, episodes of the old series, I was. But in this one, I, I kind of wanted to change things up. Have a couple, couple people with me. Some manpower. I mean, I want to play the mod for what it is. And there is bodyguards, like friendlies you can find around the map. Like, there probably is some... Yeah, there's some friendlies right here. You can actually go to them and they're friendly survivors and you can recruit them and have them on your team. So I kind of want to... They're a bit annoying. So I thought I'd, uh, <laughs> thought I'd get uh, Franklin and Michael. But yeah. Forgot to close my boot. I'm sorry. It's probably annoying some people, but it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Actually, it is kind of annoying me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shut my boot. <laughs> right, let me just quickly shut that. Jesus. Come on. Hey, watch it. There we go. There we go. Close the trunk. All good. Okay. Hop back in, boys. We're good. Oh, that's a lot of zombies in front of us. All right. Everyone in? Yeah. Yeah, we're good. All right. We definitely need some fuel, though. Gonna have to stop at a fuel station that hopefully does have a uh, have a cherry can. So we'll go this way for now and we'll stop there first. So yeah, I really don't want to run out of fuel before actually getting to where we're where we're going. Where's the mini map? I took it off uh, just to make the game more immersive. Really, <clears throat> games without HUD just kind of look look a lot crisper. Although I do have a big <laughs> the speedo on the on the right, but that just that's just there to show me my fuel. Oh, my fuel is low, not good. I'm just trying to get to the fuel station quick. That's all we need to do. We should be good, hopefully, hopefully. Like if worse comes to worse, we're gonna have to just walk to the fuel station and come back and refuel the car. I mean, I don't want to leave this one. This is a good one. What's this car called again? Granger, Granger, I think. Yeah. I'm trying to remember where the closest fuel station is. I think it's, uh... Isn't it? Oh. Why am I being forgetful right now? I think we got a fuel station... Just up there somewhere? Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up here and to the left. Alright. If there's not a jerry can there... Oh my Nothing. gosh. I shouldn't have looked at chat. <laughs> We're getting real low on fuel. Now, another another really scary thing about this mod is uh, when you're running low on fuel, you're not just running low on fuel. Your car starts to play up. It does little backfires and it's just it's just not, not healthy. So that's real scary. But yeah, we got a fuel station just up here. You only have yourself to Where is play. it behind me? Wait. I think I've lost my mind. Where? Oh, <laughs> I swear it was just here, wasn't it? Uh-oh. Not in a good position. Not in a good position. I swear it's just here somewhere. Maybe it's on this corner. Kenji, hi. Hey, hope you're doing well. Thanks for stopping by. It's a lot of zombies. Oh my gosh. Yeah, my car's starting to play up now. This is not good. No, it wasn't a fuel station I was thinking of. It was the damn store. Okay. Might have to leave the car here, because look at it. It's not doing too good. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, no. It's not going to be good. Car is dead. Yep. I knew there was a store. I was just... Just, <laughs> just mistook it for a, for a fuel station. Oh, wait. Is this a fuel station just up ahead? It is. I think. It is! Maybe I... Because I know, I know the map so well. But I was a liquor store back there. Okay. Car is really not doing good. And just to show you I'm not faking it. I use the controller to drive the car and my mouse and keyboard to run around and aim and stuff. So I'm always swapping. Oh, there's no jerry can. There is no jerry can. Okay, no runners. Okay, well, let's quickly, uh... We'll take that back out. We, we're definitely gonna... I don't want to leave it in there for now. We, uh, we gotta get going, boys. 
Could go on foot by the looks then. Gotta find a different car. Need a base bro to stay. Yeah, that's what that's where we're getting to right now. That's our main objective. And I have a really good uh, idea for where to go. I'm getting hungry and thirsty too. So when I get in this car, I'll quickly have some water. Water. Alright. Uh, clean ah, water. Stir, you piece of shit. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna hop out, take this guy out, then use my vehicle repair kit. You dumbass! Oh, fuck Holster it. No, not loot. Repair. Stop it! Why is it saying cancel? I'm trying to repair. Hey! I did repair? Okay. Well, let me configure you guys back to guard because I feel like I'm gonna need you to be on guard. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's put you on follow. Let's put you on guard. You're not gonna wanna hop in the car with me, and you need to. Alright, come on. Let's go. Oh, sorry, Franklin. I'm so sorry. Wang Fist. Howdy, bro. Another day in paradise to see. It is, it is. Good to see you here, man. Hope you're doing well. Alright, so we got some decent hey, fuel out. in this. I mean, we need a bit of a beefy car. Uh, oh, also, Wang Fist. <laughs> We uh we got some upgrades. We got uh got some friends. We got <laughs> Michael skipping the, the finger. <laughs> oh, they're zombies, Michael. They don't take insults. They don't care about them. They don't even recognize them. I guess it's just for Michael's own sanity. Like if he doesn't insult some zombies, he's gonna be pretty pretty down about it later on when he's trying to sleep. So yeah, we're gonna head over to the airport, and I'll show you where. Where my little base area is that I'm thinking of using. I'm pretty sure it should be good. We got enough stuff to, uh... Why is there a boat there? Not sure. But, uh, we got enough stuff to definitely craft enough sand blocks. Okay. Yeah, Gotta quickly you. make a pit stop here, get Fuck this can. Now. Why are you, still you need, like, all the overgrown stuff, like grass in the street and stuff. Yeah, yeah, I had that in the, uh, first series. Um, haven't got to that yet in, in this series. But in the first one we did. Los Santos was completely ruined, but yeah, this is just the second episode of the the fresh series, so just getting started with things slowly. But yeah, let's uh, let's continue. Michael, you need to relax a little bit. Oh, you got the boys hanging with her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, a zombie apocalypse gets pretty lonely. Exist? I'm out of fuel. Lucky I picked up a jerry can because I'm smart. Okay, let me refuel. No, not repair engine. The engine's fine. I just need to refuel. Oh, uh, it's, it's being a bit buggy right now. There we go. There we go. We're good. We're good. We're good. No zombies. There is, but they're not coming over to us, so we're good. Okay, I'm going to have a sip of my coffee before I forget and it gets cold. I subscribe to you because you're good, mate. <laughs> hey, thanks, Kenji. I appreciate it. We're so close to 2,000 on this channel. We've been going, been going good on this channel uh, lately. What, why is my car not starting? Don't tell me I have to use another engine repair kit. The engine didn't break. Okay. Okay, we'll do it. We'll do it. You guys ready? You guys can stay in the car. You know that. I mean, it's yeah, you're here to protect me. It makes sense. It's good. Right, let's go, boys. Let's do this. Items minus one. Oh, it makes sense, yeah. My car's not starting. Just a heads up. This, uh, this, there is a few bugs with this mod sometimes. Okay, I think we're gonna have to go on foot. Gonna have to go on foot, boys. You guys ready? Come on. Come on, Franklin. Hop out. Let's go. Unless we find a car on the way. I mean, we, <laughs> we could take this if it's not broken. It's not broken. It's not broken. <laughs> That's amazing. But yeah. Uh, anyway, if you guys are enjoying, uh, make sure to leave a like. I really appreciate it. I mean, you don't have to, but it uh, helps out the channel and pushes this stream out to more people. Let's YouTube know that 
that people are interested. But yeah, <laughs> we gotta. This is temporary, okay? It's temporary. We're not. We're not keeping this. I gotta. Gotta chuck a U-turn here. We're not keeping this. We're just using this to get to where we need to get. Because uh, yeah, unfortunately, we ran out of fuel. I wasted the fuel in the car. And uh, yeah. Why don't you? Do they shoot off? zombies with you, or do they just chill? Yeah. Uh, they sh they shoot with me, yeah. Uh, I can set them to guard or chill or follow, or look at Michael. <laughs> um, yeah, like they shoot anything. L literally, they they will shoot birds if it, if they're close. I'm not even kidding. They were doing that uh, just before I went live when I was setting things up. <laughs> so I guess I guess when they want to guard, they they guard me from everything. So yeah, I'll Fuck use off. this to. Uh, you know something, you fucking okay. okay. Michael, you need to relax a bit. You, suck. you don't need to shoot everyone yet. Just follow me. Come on. We got a good place. We got a good place to go. Come on. Are you guys serious? Okay, no, he's, he's got it. He's got it. Okay, cool. Hi. Why, oh, why weren't you drowned at birth? Guys, come on. Yeah, okay. Awesome. Okay. So. If I remember correctly, it should be just around here. There's a little opening, and you can get in behind behind the hangar. I think it's part of the hangar. Um, yeah, is, is it this door? Yeah, it's this door right here. I'm pretty sure we can we can go on through here. Yes! Hassan, yo! Yo! What's going on, man? Hope you're doing well. Glad to see you here. Yeah, we have... Um, Oh, it doesn't look like we can use them. I was going to say, if we could use them, that could be like a good source of, uh, uh, thirst, I guess. But I mean, it's not really good for you. Uh, well, at least we got a first aid kit there. Okay. Why are you guys fighting people right now? You just need to relax. You just need to relax. Okay, so we're not rich enough in terms of resources to completely block off the whole front there, but we can block off bits here and keep this like little air. Franklin, I'm not going to shoot you, man. It's all good. Don't need to worry about that. It's all good. So, uh, we'll quickly just have some food and water. Block off one entrance. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to... Um, going to block... A oh, i got to craft these. going to block off a little area here so we can have a crafting table, crafting bench, um fire and tent and whatever else we need so block off a little area for now and uh as we progress further in the series obviously make bases bigger and stuff like that but for now we'll just make it make it simple a little little bit spacious we don't need too much space i mean we're just trying to survive at the moment Get the but fuck out of my way trevor it's your friend it's your friend trevor you just need to relax my friend trevor franklin kind of in the way a little Okay. It's a bit too spacious. I didn't mean for it to be this spacious. Uh, let's craft some more. Okay. We don't have too many more. At the moment, it's going to be a little bit ugly, okay? We're going to have to just... Uh, going to have to do what we can with it. That's all good. It's all good. It's just a start. So, everyone watching right now that wants to see me kill a bunch of zombies, well, make sure you stick around, okay? Because we, we're going to need more resources to continue building this. So, we are going to have to fight zombies. Like, a lot of them. Um, while I'm here, let me just jump over this quickly. Come on, Michael, come over here. Um, I'll place my tent down. You guys don't need it. Actually, no. Yeah, you guys can share the tent with me, okay? I trust you. It's not weird. It's not weird, alright? Gotta stay warm. <laughs> um, and we'll also put down our fire. Uh, where's our campfire? There we go, there we go. And we should be able to cook some extra meat from that too, since we're near it. Uh, there's no campfire nearby. There is. Okay, we've got some... Make some extra clean water. Perfect. Look at that. We're doing good. We're doing good. Um, we can also put up barriers. No, I'm gonna need to, um... Actually, I'll place my weapons crate down while we're here. There we go. And our workbench. Okay, so we've got things sorted for now. Now! As I always say, this is like Minecraft. In Minecraft, you cannot sleep if there are monsters nearby. If there's zombies nearby, it's not going to allow me to sleep. So let's uh, quickly, quickly check if we can sleep and then I'll read the chat. We can sleep! Perfect! Block block the gate for hangar. 
Do you mean like block the hangar with gates? That'll require a lot of gates. That's, that's early morning. This will be good enough. This will be good enough. Okay. Uh, I'll just go ahead and save everything that I got here. And uh, then we should be good to go. You guys ready? I mean, do I have plenty of ammo? I think I do. You guys ready to go zombie hunting? You, come on. You guys ready? Everyone watching, are you guys ready to go zombie hunting? It's like the best part of this series, right? <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, uh, I think Franklin. Oh, I got one too. I know. I have. I know, Michael. I'm looking at Franklin. I think he's a bit scared. I'm gonna have to. Gonna have to tell him that. Uh, they're more scared of him than he is of them. Franklin, you ready? We'll go out this way. I mean, maybe. Maybe he's got sore legs. Maybe he's been like hitting the gym. He's on leg day or something. He doesn't feel like jumping over there. So. We can go around this way and meet up with Michael. Nothing more fun than just slaughtering zombies for hours. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Everyone follow him? Make me want ammo but... Come on, let's go meet up with Michael. Michael's cool. Michael's older than, uh... Than Frank. Wait. Franklin! Franklin! I'm out! Come on! Come on, buddy! Franklin! <laughs> Franklin! What are you doing? Okay. Okay. It's alright. Here, come on. I, I know the way. I know the way. You just follow me and I'll, I'll help you out. Okay, we'll have to remove a sand block. He's too scared to go out that way because uh, it's not as open, so he's a bit scared, okay? That's why he's worried. We'll pick up this sand block for now. You follow me and uh, try and figure out where Michael went. <laughs> Man, this is like trying to look after children. <laughs> there he is. There's Michael. With All right. Tasks. Well, uh, here we go. Let's go kill some hordes of zombies. Yes, sir. Let's do it. Okay, there's not too many hordes in here because it's an airport. Nice work. So, uh, you know, it's mainly just workers and and people getting off and getting getting ready to hop on planes. So it's not too many, but we'll go around and we'll exit, go into the main airport area, and uh, yeah, we'll kill some zombies, do I'm a bunch of looting. Up. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Can't use commands like move here or go there. Uh, I don't think you can. I'm just using... Uh, no, I, I don't... I'm not sure. Maybe with, like, a separate mod. But with this, it's just, uh... I can... I can configure them to be, like, guarding me, standing... St oh, here's a bunch of zombies. Oh, this is a lot of zombies. Pistol time. You got it. Come on, boys. Get him. I gotta reload. Get him, we gotta get the loot. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Shoot you in the foot. What the hell, man? Actually, no. Shotgun time. Shotguns are just so fun. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Mark, you don't need to insult the zombies. <laughs> That's so hilarious. Franklin, I think Franklin's a little bit scared still, honestly. He's not, he's not doing much shooting. He didn't want to leave the hangar. Like, I understand, like, I mean, I want to go and fight zombies to get resources, but sometimes it's kind of, kind of a bit scary. I get it, Franklin, but it's all good. You're a strong man. You're a good man. I believe in you. Let's go. Party time. All right. Yeah, I like to switch it up every now and then, go first person. Change it up a little. Idiot. Hi. Trick shot. <laughs> can you fly the plane? Uh, I think I don't think you can fly that one, but there's probably one over there. I can. Um, I'd like to fly the plane, but I like to kind of keep the series going in a way where it's kind of practical and useful. And I, I don't really see any reason to fly a plane at the moment. We have a helicopter in case we need. I just love how the shotgun just makes him backflip. It's it's so satisfying. Getting all the loot right now. Man, this guy had a nice job. He's got a nice Moron. suit. It's a shame. Oh. Whoa. Oh, he doesn't want to die. Look. Oh, that's so sad. Oh, he's so strong. Such a strong man. Sorry about the gore. 
Sorry. <laughs> if you play the zombie mode in first person, it gets a little scary. It does. That's why I like switching to it every now and then. It's kind of, kind of cool. And it makes the graphics look different too, in a way. It's more close to things. Things are rendered in slightly higher detail. All right, I think I'm running low on shotgun ammo though. Yeah, I am. Everyone watching at the moment, fuck, fuck. Uh, if you didn't watch the last episode, unfortunately, there's a bug happening where when I craft ammo with the resources at the crafting bench, it doesn't actually give me any ammo besides pistols. So I'm, I am having to use my menu to give myself ammo. Otherwise, I just oh, can't get ammo for other really guns. So, suck. so yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to do that shortly. It kind of ruins the immersion of the zombie apocalypse, but yeah. We we gotta do it, otherwise there's no way we can get ammo. What's going on with you, dickhead? Go fuck yourself! Michael, Hold just straight. relax. <laughs> oh man. Alright, trick shot. Oh, give me <laughs> okay. Stop mess stop messing around, mister. Gotta take it seriously. Next thing you know, I'm gonna be like 360 no scoping off the top up there. Total All right, sw switch the pistol for now. We don't want to waste too much ammo. All right, let's go ahead and loot all these guys. When you fight a lot of zombies at once. Oh, like uh, when you're in first person fighting a lot of zombies at once, it gets scary. Yeah, it does. It's so cool though, being able to turn GTA 5 into, into a full survival game like this. Obviously, it's lacking story and stuff like that, but the experience in general is still pretty good. Especially when you add other mods. Man. If anyone's new just stopping by, by the way, at night time, uh, I often remind everyone about this, but at night time they get more aggressive and there's a lot of runners. There's runners in daytime too, but not as many. Man, we're getting the resources. Anyway, let's switch back to third person for now. You make me want emigrate. You guys doing good? Resources? Last guy was seven resources. It's pretty good. Sometimes it's better to make your own story anyway. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I agree. I mean, I try to. <laughs> Not many of you were here the second I went live, like at the start, um, because obviously I just went live. Uh, but I had to come up with a story of how I found uh, these guys. I got one too. Unfortunately, Just they ruined the surprise, but that's all right. All right, let's let's continue hunting. We definitely do need as many resources as possible. Plus, we get food and water from these guys too that we can cook later at the campfire. Like that's good. Can't you find some new weapons and guns at the police station or military base? Yeah, there's weapons hidden around in different areas. <clears throat> um. For example, the sniper I, I have, I found at the airport here in the first episode. Oh my god, runner. Why hasn't someone yeah, sensible shot you yet? Oh. Alright. So yeah, if we go up high places, like in general where you'd think you'd maybe find some weapons in games in general, there probably is. So like on the top of here or something, there's a chance there could be weapons. Why, oh, why do you exist? oh my that gosh, my aim. That was bad. Shot. Go park house for a car. I gotta reload. Park house? Oh, Look, okay, yeah, I know what you mean. Got a problem with me. Listen, even your parents fuck are you alive? Really? Um, what weapons do I have? I got some decent assault rifles. And I got them, um... From... From killing some enemies. Which is good. Speaking of that, actually, we should look for a Mer Meriwether loot drop. There doesn't seem to be any at the moment, actually. But yeah, there's loot drops in this. Every every now and then, it's just randomized. The uh, Meriwether will drop loot with resources and weapons and things like that. So look out for the little notification for that. And uh, we're going to be careful because there will be other enemy survivors that are going to want to take that and going to gonna fight for their life trying to kill us so they can get it. So I'm going to have to be careful. Me want a lobotomy. Michael, you're very aggressive. I mean, it's good, but... I mean... <laughs> it's just loud. 
Yeah, unfortunately we didn't seem to find a car in the bottom level here. I don't want to go up top because if I do... Oh! You are utterly ridiculous! If I do, it's going to take a while for these guys to get back down. <laughs> Michael, you're so funny, man. Oh, wow. Alright. Moron! Alright. Man, this lady was just a photographer walking around. Probably a tourist. Now she's just a zombie. She probably had a nice family, a couple kids, nice house, a good husband. But unfortunately, the virus has taken over. The virus? I don't even know. Something happened. I can't remember it, but I explained it in the first episode. <laughs> Alright. Look at you just standing here by yourself. I think you deserve a... No, we don't have enough shotgun. Okay. Want to play co Do you mean co-op? Uh, this is single player. I'm not able to play with anyone, unfortunately. I think there is a mod that you can play uh, with friends on single player. But I haven't got that set up or anything. And... Um, I kind of plan to just keep this as a solo series. Oh, there's a lot right here. Oh, look at them all. There's so many. I mean, I see it as a lot of zombies, but I also see it as just infinite resources. And I'm just glad it's daytime, because they're so much easier to kill at day. They're not as active, but at night, they're just, they get hungry. And they just start running constantly, even at your car. Listen, nobody likes you. But uh, what we might do is go down to the original car park we went in the first episode and see if we can find a decent car there. Uh, do I still have a jerry can? I don't. I'm struggling to keep cars. All these are broken. But I mean, it's hard when sometimes the bugs are happening where they're, you know, the fuel's not actually refueling the car. That can be annoying. Hey, PJ. Oi. Oi, mate. <laughs> Hope you're doing well, PJ. Glad to see you here. What the fuck? <laughs> oh man, the voice lines of these guys hilarious. Okay, we gotta we gotta have a little food and water quickly. Uh, what do we got? Cooked meat, water. Okay, we should be good. We should be good. Definitely need more ammo. And as I said, there is a bug that's not allowing me to craft ammo at all, really. So I do have to give it to myself with the menu unfortunately um so where is it weapon options uh, run I tried it. guys do you want to back me up Jesus. Blind fool. now you're gonna back me up oh man that's funny okay um currently held weapon fill ammo and we've got to give ourselves some shotgun ammo too. Okay, we should be good. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Let's head down to the car park and, uh... And we should be good. Man, the shotgun just sounds so powerful. Why can't I loot? There we go. Can't loot this one for some reason. It's strange. You guys ready? Come on. This is cheating, bro. It's... It's not because... Well, I know it's a mod menu, but I have to have the mod menu in general to load some of the things in this mod. But when I get the resources and craft ammo at the crafting bench in this mod, it's not giving me any ammo. There's a bug at the moment. So if I don't do that, there's no way for me to get ammo for any other gun. I know it seems like cheating, but yeah. I mean, otherwise I'm going to have to run around with a only a pistol for the whole series. Yeah, we got some cars down here. I don't, I don't want to use the menu to give myself ammo, obviously. I want to keep this series as clean as possible, but... That's all we have to do, otherwise we're going to have none. Alright, let's find a decent car. I mean, I'd like to take the little cool car, that would be cool. Franklin! Is that your car? Let's take that, man! Oh, it's a bit broken. Someone's already banged it up, okay. Why? Why weren't you Guys, quickly... Oh, I need a vehicle repair kit. Let me see if I can quickly craft one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, repair engine. Wangfist with the five. Again. Thank you, man. Great great stream, bro. Fun series. Thank you. Really appreciate that. 
<clears throat> yeah, uh... You guys don't know besides, I think, one or two people at the start of the stream, but... Jesus. Let me just quickly show you something. Um... <laughs> this is what happened. See how my microphone has a bunch of tape on it? About 15 minutes before I went live, I was adjusting the microphone, changing the, the angle of it, and the piece that connects it to the microphone arm completely snapped off. And there's no other way I can stick it on because <laughs> this mic is quite heavy. I had to just tape it. This is hanging on just by tape. I had to use so much tape. How unfortunate is that? 15 minutes before I go live, my microphone breaks. And I even had to bring out my old mic arm, the really old rusty one, because I was, I was just worried that nothing was going to work. But yeah. Just how, how stupid is that for that to happen 15 minutes before stream? Anyway, let's get back to the game. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Luckily, I'm, I'm, my new mic is coming on the 7th of September, so that's not too long, but this tape, I don't know how long it's gonna, it's gonna last. You know something? You're fucking pathetic! Oh well, all that sucks. Mic don't feel so good. No. You could have imagined my panic, because I scheduled the stream, and I don't want to... I don't want to cancel a scheduled stream that people are expecting. So, uh, I was just panicking, thinking, do I even have tape? The, the plastic piece broke, there's no way for me to put it back on. I can't play it holding it with one hand. And I can't put it on the desk uh, stand either, because that connects to the piece that actually broke on the Go mic arm, so... Yourself. That's annoying. Um... Yeah, you we should... Suck. We should go to a fuel station. Get an extra jerry can for later. This car is full of fuel, so that's good. We'll do that, and uh, then we're gonna head back to base, and uh, hopefully call that base home eventually. I mean, we haven't had a solid base yet, and that that one seems like a pretty solid base. We've got a hangar, and we've got a little little dedicated area we've uh, sand blocked off for now. That's probably gonna work quite hey, well. Place, home. So, uh, you fuck off. Yeah, I'm trying to think where the nearest gas station is. Oh, it's just over. Just over there, in front of us. We'll go there. Alright. Duct tape is a lifesaver. It is. It is. I, I used so much on this. It doesn't look like like such an ex excessive amount, but it really is. There's so much duct tape on this. I mean, it, there's not much left on the roll. Because it's a heavy mic, so I really had to just use, like, a bunch. Uh, but hopefully it lasts and holds up. Piece of shit. Because I have to wait until yeah, the 7th of September for my new mic to come. Now. It's getting shipped from quite far away. Alright, alright. Wait, where am I going? The gas station I'm thinking of is... Oh, it's just down here to the right. We're good, we're good. We're all good. There better be a jerry can there. At least we can loot some food and water and whatnot from the store that's there too. That'll be good. Grove Street, home. Got at least it was before I fuck things up. Anyway. Okay. I know there's probably some younger people. Oh, this, this doesn't open. That's strange, because it usually does. not looking to open that that's really weird maybe you get sponsored by duct tape brands now <laughs> i mean i'm up for it for the laugh <laughs> yeah it's not gonna let me in okay that's fair enough okay we got plenty of fuel and we got a we got a jerry can now so we're good we're good yo if any duct tape brands want to reach out no i'm just kidding <laughs> Fuck you, michael are you alive? Michael! Fucking oh, idiot! Shit. Car, use the car. I mean, okay. I'll give it a go. I mean, it is night. And I don't know if you guys saw, but in the bottom left, just before it said nightfall approaches, zombies are far more aggressive at night, so you gotta be careful. Hold it down! Michael, relax. I know what I'm doing, okay? Oh, see, they chase your cars and everything. Absolutely insane. Alright, yeah. It'll be best we head back to base. We've got a tent there so we can sleep if we need. Got some pretty good resources. Had some fun killing zombies. Not doing too bad just yet. Doing good, doing good. And I mean, we're doing good for fuel too. We've got the spare jerry can, so... 
I'm glad about that. It's good. You want to like. <laughs> uh, thanks, Cosponus. Yeah, correct me if I'm wrong. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. All right, all right. Oh, that's right. I blocked that off. Oh, no, we should be good. These don't seem to... Oh, no, it's opening now. Okay. It didn't earlier. Hey, hey! It's all good, Michael. You guys need to tell Michael to stop stressing a bit. Man, you've been Do you mean, uh, home. call me Ebra? Okay. Right, we'll park our car here for now. I mean... That's good. While we're here, we'll refuel it quickly, so we definitely got enough fuel for whenever we go out and use it next. You gonna let me refuel, game? There we go. There we go. Nice. Alright. Yeah, while I'm doing this, I just want to say thank you to everyone recently for the all the, all the support. Like, the, my channel's been doing really good these last, I think, 15 or 20 days. Uh, why is Trevor running so weird with that? Put it away. Look how he runs. He runs like he's... <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Okay. Anyway, we need to put this extra sand block up um, once everyone gets in here because you guys don't seem to know how to get out. So, uh, yeah, come on. Come on. Come on in. Come on down. Good work. Place that in and we should be good. All right. You guys, you guys eating and drinking? You're not hungry or thirsty or anything? You got your own food and water? Like, I haven't heard you ask me for any, so I'm not sure. I mean, they should be good, right? I think they're good. I think they're good. Okay, well, uh, we're not too thirsty or hungry, but we will be after a sleep, so... The good thing about this base, too, is... Zombies are pretty far away. I mean, they're not likely to walk straight in here, so it's much easier to sleep. Because, obviously, we can't sleep if there's zombies close by. It won't let us, so I'll have to kill them off. But zombies don't get too close around here, so... It's great. What's the time on my broken phone that somehow has charge? 5.51, okay. It's a good start to the morning. Uh, what do you guys think we should be doing? NDR, yo, hello. Hello. Hope you're doing well. Glad to see you here. Oh, they don't know how to jump over. Okay. But yeah, what, what do you think we should do now? I mean, I haven't seen a Meriwether weapons drop. We should probably go and drive around and look for one of them. I'd really like if you guys could jump over this block because the car is right here and we're going to need to hop in it. I'm going to have to remove the sand block for him. <laughs> Your channel is part of my after afternoon routine now, lol. <laughs> hey, well, I'm glad, I'm glad. That's all I want. I just like, uh... I like giving people something to do during the day if they're bored or not having a good day or something. If I can fill that little gap in with a video or a stream or something random or something funny, then I'm happy. But yeah, I guess uh, if we drive around for a bit now, if we, if we leave here, hopefully there'll be a Meriwether drop soon. Because that'll give us extra supplies, extra weapons, and I think it comes with ammo too. I think. Uh, because yeah, obviously, the actual way to get ammo, not working. Not working at all, so it'll be nice to get the ammo from a from a drop i'm gonna quickly see i think it might be blo bugged blugged so let me just turn survivors off then back on and that should maybe cause a drop to start because sometimes i've noticed drops just randomly stop working so you have to enable and re-enable things sometimes but yeah we're good Go ride the rides at the pier. I mean, that would be a pretty cool place to go zombie hunting, honestly. Nice pier. Seagulls. Sound of the ocean. Zombies. Kind of remind me of Dead Island. Uh, ever play Mass Effect? I think I have. Um, but it might have been like one of the, the early, early ones. I don't even know how many there are. I'm not too experienced with Mass Effect. Michael, you need to just quiet down a bit. They're gonna... They're attracted to noise, don't you know, Michael? Can you upgrade your car? 
I don't think you can with this mod. I'm sure there's a mod I could add that would allow me to do car upgrades. But, I mean, actually, maybe if we're in luck. Let's grab another jerry can while we're here, if there's one. Maybe if we're in luck, Los Santos Customs would be working. So we can go and try that out, actually. It says press RB to refuel. I can just... I completely forgot, guys. The main zombies mod lets you refuel with jerry cans, but the reason I have this speedometer with the fuel gauge, that's another mod that also allows you to refuel just by being next to a gas station. So that's really helpful. Go fuck yourself. Since you can op uh, enter... No fucking point to you. Michael's voice is so loud in my ears compared to what you guys hear because I've turned down the game volume on stream, so I apologize. <laughs> It's really hard to concentrate and talk at the same time while he's talking. Uh, since you can enter any building that was open to missions, you should see if there are weapons in the motorcycle clubhouse. Alright. I mean, I, oh wait, no. I mean, we could check it out, but honestly, the mod itself that places the weapons randomly, they're all manually placed by the person who created the mod. So it would be pretty unlikely that it would be in usually up? unaccessible interiors. Why are you still breathing? But I want to see if Los Santos Customs still works, because it would be nice to repair my car. If it does, then that's that's amazing. That's amazing. It seems a little bit cheaty, but if there's a guy who's still working in there, I mean, I've just ran out of fuel. I just refueled. How have I ran out of fuel? Just before I got the Los Santos customs right. <laughs> what are the chances of that, everyone? We uh, we're kind of stuck in now. We're gonna have to hop out. That is a. Uh, that's really unfortunate. Hostiles nearby? Whereabouts? Uh, over there. Okay, okay, okay. I mean, we can go and try and fight them. Maybe they have a decent car. Do what I'm, that's what I'm saying. Okay, it can be quite hard to uh. Keep a car in this game because I, as you saw, I just refueled my car and it bugged out somehow and now it's empty. That's, that's really strange. Oh, there's a you runner. Make me want Let's go. Oh, that's okay. If you can find like one of those rusty looking you cars, like a zombie movies, that would be cool. I was actually looking Move. at, I can't loot her. I was actually looking at adding some custom, like, apocalyptic vehicles to this, but I couldn't find any perfect ones, like, to my liking, so I haven't done that yet. But yeah, let's see if we can go... Are those hostiles too? Oh, they're coming. They're on their way. Uh, they're, they're, they're literally right here. Okay, uh, guys, we gotta prepare. I'm pulling out my assault rifle. I can hear that car. It's just up here somewhere. Okay, come on, boys. Michael Franklin, we gotta go up here. They're fighting zombies. I don't even know we're here. We can sneak up on them. They're gonna have some weapons, extra loot and stuff like that. It's gonna be perfect. It's gonna be perfect. There was a hole in the gas tank. <laughs> it must have been, right? Oh! Oh, it's a zombie. I thought I just meleeed. I thought I just I meleeed, like, Michael or something. Okay, well, we managed to kill him. That's good. So why do you <sighs> Jeez. Alright, so much for resources. What gun do you have? <laughs> you think you're tough. She, you I've already I've already got that rifle. That's why it won't let me pick it up. Oh, well, we managed to survive. I mean... Oh, no, no, I meant to loot. You know oh, yet. there's a drop nearby. Just up there. Okay, boys, we've got to hop in the car. We've got to get to the drop real quick before it goes away. Come on. This is our chance. This is our chance for some extra supplies and resources and everything like that. Yeah, you. Michael, put off. your finger away. Now. It's a zombie. Michael. You suck. <laughs> That's so funny. That's hilarious. Okay, where was the drop? It was up here to the right, right? Yeah, okay. Be careful. Michael, trust me, okay? It's a zombie apocalypse. If I'm driving a bit reckless, it's all good. It's all good. Everything's good. 
Oh my gosh. The handling and the turning circle in this car are so strange. <laughs> Obviously it's old car, that's why. Oh, it doesn't even go up the hill properly. Fuck you. Okay, where's the drop? Uh, okay, we're almost there, almost there. Oh, am I in the zone? If I'm in the zone, then it's good. No, fail to retrieve crate. Yeah. Oh man, that was so close. Ooh, piece of shit. That was so close, it was just here. I ain't in this car. You are in the car, Michael. It's true. Ah oh, man, okay, um... Hmm. That was so close, the drop was just around here. Man. Fuck off! What are you doing? Vinewood Star Tours leaving now. The hedges in front of Star's home. What do you think you're doing? What's going on with you, dickhead? We still have seats available. <laughs> leaving right now, just forty dollars. Ma'am. Uh oh. Listen, like even your parents are way down. Nice work. You know what? I'm sorry. Oh. Oh my gosh, this guy's doing backflips and stuff. I didn't need to kill her, I'm sorry. I apologize for that, but... I think she was just extremely delusional, and I couldn't tell if it was because the virus was starting to take over her body, or if she was just a little bit dumb. Alright. I just want to wait for the next drop. If we can, uh... If we can get one of these drops, it's gonna be perfect. Station wagon and zombie apocalypse is not a great choice. It's not... I mean, it's cool. In my opinion, I love, I love old cars. And this is a cool old car. Kenji, bye, see ya. See you, Kenji. Thanks for stopping by. Hope you have a great night or day, whatever time it is. Alright, oh, there, there is a drop. There is a drop. Uh, one of these cars working, otherwise I can go back to the other one. No, okay, I'm gonna have to go back to the other one quickly. Come on, guys. Gotta get there. Actually, no, I have a vehicle repair kit. Let's just do it. No, I don't. Oh my gosh, okay. I don't want to run out of time. I really want to get this drop. Go away. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Get in the car. Get in the car. Let's go. Okay, where's this drop? Okay, it's up there. We should have enough time. Go fuck yourself. Michael just loves flipping a bird to the zombies. I mean, I think it's a hobby of his. He probably did it to the zombie movies before the apocalypse started. Man, this is not a great choice of car for this. Uh, what's the quickest way? Okay, straight up, straight over here. We definitely need a faster car. A more reliable fuel gauge because the other ones seem to be completely lying. Oh, man. I guess it makes the... The mod more fun and difficult because there are little bugs and stuff so you have to kind of kind of do your own thing from there if things things get ruined i mean we're running out of time no if our car mysteriously runs out of fuel here we're not gonna make it why don't you fuck off okay okay what? we're here now you we're gonna look exist. for the red flare i've just ran out of fuel Gosh, okay, it's better to be on foot anyway when versing these guys. The red flare, I'm guessing it'll be up here. Yeah, there it is. Right there. Okay, so we're gonna be real careful. Come on. I hope you guys can jump the fence. Okay, good. I'm gonna need you guys. Yeah, there they are. Okay, let me just take this dude out. This guy's drunk. Okay. We can go for a snipe on him. Where are they? One up there. Is he dead? Okay. The zombies are kind of slow at the moment, so we're good. Uh, how are we going to get over this fence? Ram it with a car and then jump. But we need to get over there and get that drop. You're a total moron. Isn't there an entrance up here anyway? I think so. Yeah, right here actually. Well, we got a drop, so that's good. What's your favorite show and movie? Uh, I don't really watch shows and movies these days. When I was younger, I did. But I guess show, there'll be multiple. Um, I like shows with really stupid comedy. So things like uh, The Office, 
Parks and Recreation. Um, and one that I think is not as popular, but in my opinion is really good, was The Peep Show. It's hilarious. <clears throat> in terms of movies, I'm not really, really too sure. I've just watched basically every horror movie there is. I enjoy horror movies. Uh, I don't know. There's a lot of movies I like, I just don't really watch that many these days. Okay. Can I get this? Is this bugged? Don't tell me this is bugged, the only drop we got. I might have to get this car and quickly jump on the roof of it. Alright. Don't worry about helping in, boys. I'm just, uh, I need to get over here. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Yeah. What did we get? Found five weapons? We have a double barrel shotgun. A new, uh, the AP pistol? It's a bit overpowered. We don't really need a auto pistol. Got a new... Okay, we're gonna have to drop that. That, yeah, we're not using a unholy hellbringer in, uh... In a zombie apocalypse. Let's quickly use it just for fun, okay? Just for fun. Might as well waste it and then drop the weapon. We don't need it. I'm not going to use this in this series. <laughs> Alright. Let's just drop this weapon. We don't... We don't need that. It's a bit ridiculous. Uh, Alright. We're good. We're good. Alright, let's just loot these guys. Get another sniper? No, we didn't. We got a golf club. Actually, I'm going to use my baseball bat. Because this baseball bat is a modded one. It's not the real one. It's like a custom one with blood and barbed wire and stuff, so... Stay down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, man. Swim time. Oh, she's still alive. Uh, okay, thank you guys so much. I was panicking then. What the hell, man? What the hell, man? Oh, we got another Meriwether loot drop nearby. Okay. Well, this car's pretty decent. Let's let's hop in that. Whereabouts is it? This is good. An extra loot drop? That's really helpful. Yeah, you. Fuck off. Michael. <laughs> How the fuck are you alive? How are you alive, Michael? Oh, I am so sorry. All right. Okay, we might be able to make it there in time. This is good. This is good. Sometimes it's uh, been quite hard to um, get to the drops in time due to fuel. <laughs> really? <laughs> and weapons, not having enough weapons. But now we've got good weapons. This car seems to be doing good. Uh... I don't have the mini-map on, obviously, just to make things more immersive. So I have to keep Fuck checking the you. main map quickly. It should be just down here. We've got to look for the red flare again. Enter hostile zone. Where's the flare? Oh, right there. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Hi, guys. Zombie coming. There's a runner somewhere. Where's the runner? Right there. Right, we've got to hop back in the car quickly, guys. Come on. Now, this car seems good enough to do a little bit of rock crawling. Some uphill and downhill action, so we should be good to just stroll down here. Another loot drop, though. That's so good. That's so good. I'm so happy with that. Oh, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. NDR, yeah, gotta go now, but I'll be on for the next stream. All good, man. Why are you Thanks for stopping by. I hope you have a good day. See you next time. Let's get this drop. I don't know why the car's on top, but, uh... What did we get? 15 items? Okay, so that one didn't have any, um, weapons or anything. He just ducked that. Didn't have any weapons or anything, but, uh, had a lot of items, so that's good. We've got to check which one of these two. Oh, we're almost, we're really low on thirst. I keep forgetting about that. Um, let's quickly have some clean water and a little bit of food. Uh, hunger's still 
we'll, we'll fill our hunger. I mean, we'll be good. We'll be good. We'll, go. we'll check which one of these cars has the most fuel. Hopefully this one. Uh, just about half. What about this? This one's a bit bashed up, but it might have more fuel. No, it's got less. Okay. We'll get the other one while we're here. And then I think it'll be worthwhile checking if Los Santos Customs actually works or not. I'd imagine it won't, but I also... Go fuck yourself! Michael, you're just you so aggressive constantly. <laughs> oh, it's hilarious, uh, honestly. Just hit him. Yeah, I did. On purpose. Zombie. Doesn't feel pain. Doesn't care. Just has one objective, and that's to eat. It's kind of like me. <laughs> no. Okay, let's go check out Los Santos Customs. Because it'll be really helpful if we can repair cars there. I just uh, have a feeling that the, the dude that runs Los Santos, Cust Los Santos Customs might be, uh, Woo, might be... You hit go. that jump! Why don't you fuck off? Well, they, they were pretty supportive insist? just then with my little car jump, but then they got upset. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully he's not zombified. Let's go check it out, though. No, seems to be closed. There's a cool cars still there, though. That's cool. Alright, we got hostiles nearby. We should probably take them down. I mean, if they got other friends, they're gonna... I don't know. The word will get around that some weird man with a beard, that's aggressive, and some other weird man yeah, with no beard, you. that's aggressive, and now. some other man that doesn't like to jump over stuff, Franklin. Yeah. The word will go yeah. around that they've been killing all the other survivors, so people people won't want to mess with us. We want to be the, the most efficient survivors around. We don't want any problems going on. Okay. I'm gonna have to go catch up to them again. Wait, it was this way, right? Yeah. Alright, so if we can take these dudes out, we'll set the example for the next ones. So let's go do that. You guys ready to shoot out of the windows and stuff? Oh, they're behind us now. How do they do that? Oh, there they are. Oh, yeah, they don't want to mess with us. Okay, I'm going to hop out and quickly... Uh, I need to loot these guys. There's also zombies. Oh, tri help me, guys. Okay, we all good? Okay, I gotta, gotta pull these dudes out. Excuse me. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Watch out. Alright, let me just pull this dude out too. Dude. I mean, ma'am. Sorry. Alright, 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 alright. We'll loot these zombies while we're here too. Her. She's just eating. You wanna make something out of this? What the fuck? I was looking, I was observing Franklin, are you okay? Look at all that blood man. Party time, ladies. Jeez. Okay. Let's hop back in, everyone. <laughs> man, it's been an intense episode. It's been a good episode. Fuck you. Michael has been the whole meme of this whole episode. Hilarious, honestly. Alright, well, uh, we got this car running low on fuel. I really hope the fuel doesn't keep bugging because it'd be nice to, uh, actually have reliable fuel. So, we'll stop back at another another gas station and, and see if we can fill this thing up. And hopefully, it works. It should. I mean, it used to, but it hasn't been lately. And then, uh, yeah, we'll head back to base. We've got plenty of resources, so we can get back there and get a little comfortable for a little bit before we go back out and do some more work. These are my old friendlies. I remember you guys. Is John here? No, just John's, uh, what was it? Was it John's twin cousin or John's brother? It was John's brother. And this dude I named Larry. Are you guys hopping in? There's no room. You guys fend for yourself now. I'll come back for you. I promise I will. I think. 
Oh, they'll be alright. They got weapons. They got good weapons. Good shooting skills. They're good. They're alright. Don't need to worry about them guys. It's all good. Alright. So, uh, yeah, we'll try and refill this thing up quickly and uh, make our way back to base. <clears throat> All right. I'll fill it up with the jerry can instead of the other way to refuel because I feel like the other way might be messing up the fueling if I'm doing two different ways of fueling you know what I mean so I'll just stick to this way oh and I, while I'm here actually I'll check if we can actually rob the store quickly not rob the store we're just taking the food from the shelves no it's still shut no idea why it's locked Alright, everyone hop in. Let's go. Skedaddle. Let's get out of here. Just gonna have my water first. Alright. Oh, sorry, oh, by Michael. The way, that's entirely your fault. <laughs> Trevor, it wasn't. You literally reversed while he was behind Shit the door. Oh, I gotta get my eyes checked. Alright. Back to base it is. Safe place. Home. Grove Street. Home! Nah. It's just the airport. We good. We good. We good. And our fuel seems to be good, actually. No, it's barely fueled up. It says my fuel gauge is less than half, but it says almost... almost full on the little fuel indicator. Like the little fuel text just above the... the gear indicator. It's weird. Yeah, I don't know what's happening with the fuel, but it's all good. We'll manage. Just make things more interesting, because we run out of fuel unexpectedly. So, that's cool, I guess. <laughs> right, back to base. We're good. And why not just have a little fun? you got to live a little sometimes. Always keep a full jerry can in the trunk. Yeah. I really should. I'll just have to go to another fuel station to find that. I mean, I refueled this though, and it's low on fuel, so I don't understand. Actually, I think it's because... Speedometer... No. Was it F10? No. F9? Simple fuel. Uh, I think I need to disable that. Wait, what did I do? Yeah, I think I need to disable simple fuel, so it'll just work on the fuel with the base mod of this. So we should be good now. Alright, everyone hop out. We're good, we're good. Reload your weapons if you need to. No, reload, Trevor. It's all good, it's all good. We don't need to. It's alright. Alright, might as well cook some more meat and stuff while we're here, just for later. Some extra water. So, we're doing, we're doing pretty good. I mean, we can probably expand this a little bit. We're going to need a lot of sand blocks to, to block off that place. We'll stock up on them. You know, we'll start while we're here. If we can start stocking up on sand blocks to block off the whole front of this entrance, that'll be, that'll be good. It'd be worthwhile putting a gate there so Franklin can go through because he doesn't seem to like to, like to jump over sand blocks. So, yeah, we'll place some sand blocks for now. Hostiles nearby. Oh, no. I hope they don't come over here. Because, yeah, with with this this zombie apocalypse, they do. They come over here and they, they will try and kill you. Actually, we'll start off um, with the gate, too, while we're here. I have to craft it. We'll add the gate now so we don't have to later. I can't see exactly where it needs to be that should be good enough and then what I can do is if I go to this side I can lock so now that gates locked wait the gate is gone no oh, I picked up the gate <laughs> let me place this down again quickly I'll I have to rotate it Okay, now I can lock and unlock the gate. So right now that should be open. And, uh... So now it's locked. 
And I just want to test this quickly. What was that? That should open and close, right? Yeah, there we go. Perfect. And I can lock it. So I'll just go back here and uh, we'll lock it. All right, perfect. Looking good. Looking good. Let's uh, make some more sand blocks quickly. What? It's the importance of. Oh, Would sorry, you open Franklin. Your eyes? It's the importance of farming resources so we can actually. Larry, get back in here. Larry, you're just stopping me from placing my block. <laughs> Alright. It's a good start. Good start for a base. I'm pretty happy with it. It's spacious. We can we can store big vehicles in here. We can even store a plane in here if need be. Yeah, that'll be good. Alright. Get this truck out of the way. Actually, we can probably keep this if it's got fuel. If it's not broken, it's not broken. Perfect. Everyone, hop in quickly. And we can carry a lot of survivors in here too. So we'll go ahead and back this up in here. Just put it there for now. All right. Hopefully, this part isn't too boring for people. I mean, there's a lot of a lot less people watching at the moment than there was earlier, but uh, it's because earlier we were killing a bunch of zombies. Best part. Um, yeah, something we need to do. Really need to need to figure out this base. So we'll go and place some more sand blocks here. Oh, it doesn't let me run with it. All right, come on. These cars here are annoying. Come on, really? Back off. <laughs> oh man. Oh, come on. It's so annoying to control. Guys, I need to place my stuff, please. Should probably be worthwhile making another gate over here too. All right, we're blocking it off. Look at it, our base is starting, starting to form. Looking good. Stop punching, Trevor. It's all good. All right, we go back here, pick up the other few sand blocks, place them, and uh, I don't think we need another gate for now. We can we can do that later on, but it'll definitely be worth having another there just in case. <clears throat> Can't you configure the mods so they uh, can be zombie ambushed at any time? Uh, I've looked in all the all the files that you can edit, and I uh, I can't see that. I can just see the amount of zombies, the minimum and maximum amount of zombies that can be around, spawn around you at the time. So yeah, we'll place the rest of these sand blocks quickly. I don't think that's enough. No, but it's good enough for now. Okay, doesn't need to be perfect. Figure it out later. Come on, guys. Guys. <laughs> you don't need to walk that close. Alright. And yeah, we can't craft anymore. Can we craft another gate? We might as well if we can. No. Okay, we're, we're good for now. We're good for now. I mean, look at that. We made some decent progress right there. Got a bunch of sand blocks down. Got another car, so that's good. While that's there, actually, I will save. Save all. So if I forget to save, when I load in for the next episode, all this stuff's going to be gone. So that would suck. So that's definitely locked. Yeah. All right. All right, all right. Now, I think... I mean, how long have we been streaming for? An hour and 19. Not too bad. Hour and 20 minutes, actually. I like to keep these episodes just over an hour or just under two hours. So I'm thinking maybe... What else can we do? I mean, we need we need to eat and drink. So we should do that right now. Yeah, I should do that, actually. Set one guy to watch and defend the base at all times. So I should set Larry. Michael and Franklin can stay with me. Larry, uh, he can be set up somewhere over here. I mean, I don't want him to go dying, though. 
I don't really have a good place for him to be set up, but anywhere right now is better than nowhere, I guess. So, Larry, come on over here. Take a little bit of cover right there. Just over here. A little bit closer, Larry. Good, good, sir. Okay, you're good, you're good. God. Um... <laughs> Hi, Larry. <laughs> Wait. Didn't I set you to guard? What are you doing? Are you guarding? Are you guarding? You're not going to follow me, right? Why are you standing that close? Okay, I'm kind of confused. Let me figure this what? out. If he stands still, does he still have a weapon? I don't think... I think he's still going to follow me if he's in combat, yeah? Yeah. So I need to set him to, like... But he does still follow me if I set him to guard. So he's guarding me, so therefore if I stand still... But is he going to pull out a weapon? I don't, the thing is, I don't know if he's going to pull out a weapon. He's standing still. Now, we'll figure it out next time. We'll do some more... I'll do some... Do some tests and stuff before the next episode. And make sure I got all that sorted out and figured out. But, I mean... I mean, look. It's a beautiful night. Got some teammates. Got my backpack. Got my fire. All this stuff. While we're here, actually, let's check if it works now. So... I, okay. So, I have zero ammo in that assault rifle. Now watch. If this works this time, I'm gonna be... There's not enough room for any more workbenches. Oh, I was trying to interrupt. If I make assault rifle ammo... This is for this one. The other one didn't have any... ...ammo. It actually gave me some assault rifle ammo. Okay, I'm not lying about earlier. If you watched the first episode, you know... ...it wasn't giving me any shotgun or assault rifle ammo. Uh... I guess it just depends. Like, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. That's alright. Okay. Well, uh, let's, let's go to sleep anyway. And I think, uh, I think that's where we'll leave this episode for, for now. Till next episode. So, uh, yeah. I mean, once again, I'll just save quickly. Save all, save. Uh, yeah. Not, not a bad stream. One hour, 20 minutes. I usually average about, like, one hour, 40 minutes for streams, but... I feel like we made some pretty good progress, oh, and, uh, once again, I, I did start streaming at, like, 4 in the morning, 4.30 or something. As you can see, right now, it is, uh, 5.43 in the morning. So, I'm gonna go make a coffee and stuff, and, yeah, figure out, figure out what to do for the next stream, and all that good stuff. But, yeah, everyone stopping by that, uh, you know, left a like, left a comment, chatted for a bit. Ho hopefully, everyone enjoyed it. Hope it was fun. I'm really enjoying doing this stream series, and, I mean, it's doing great on my channel. Some of the episodes have, like, a few thousand views, three thousand, some others have, like, a couple hundred. And the stream series on this, in general, is doing pretty good, so I'm glad everyone's liking it. And I'll keep continue doing it for as... I'll keep continuing doing it for as long as people enjoy. So, yeah. Anyway. Right, Hassan, see you next time. Thanks for stopping by. Everyone else left in the chat, there's only three watching at the moment, because I'm gone, I guess. But, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for stopping by. Stay happy, healthy, and hydrated. And, uh, yeah, bye-bye. Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye-bye. Hopefully, my mic is fixed sometime soon. Actually, it's the 7th of September that it comes by, the next one, but, yeah. Wish me luck. Hopefully, this one doesn't break. <laughs> it doesn't fall off. Anyway.